please can I just apologize for the sound quality in this video hopefully you can't hear it too badly but I've got a fan right there actually I might turn it down I turned it down so hopefully it's not too loud hi guys welcome back some of you guys may recognize this background I felt nostalgic today and I thought let's go somewhere where my channel really started like this background is where my channel really began where I really fell in love with making videos. The old fireplace in my dad's living room. I used to film all my videos here. I felt like coming back to my old spot. So today I'm really excited because I'm bringing you your favorite. I'm bringing you an ASOS haul today. Today I'm gonna bring you guys an ASOS haul and not just any ASOS haul. This is an ASOS sale haul. I'm gonna show you the bargains, the bargains that I picked up in the ASOS sale. But before I get into the items, I just wanna give a quick shout out to this video's sponsor. I'm so excited to be partnering with ShopTagger again. I actually did a video with ShopTagger probably like nine months or so ago, and I'm really thrilled that they wanted to work with me on another video. ShopTagger is a website and also an app, there's a mobile version, which helps you save money on makeup, fashion, homeware, etc. What you do is you sign up to ShopTagger and on signing up using your email address or whatever, however you wanna do it, you get a little extra button on your toolbar, which is the ShopTagger S. And what you can do is browse your favorite website and if it is out of stock or a little bit out of your price range, all you have to do is click the S and you can save it on your shop tagger page into whatever category it fits into. You make your own categories. So I have one for fashion, one for beauty, and one for homeware. And you just save it into your folder. And basically what shop tagger does is notifies you when the product goes on sale. So it also shows you if it's come back in stock. So if you really want an item and you want to be First on it, as soon as it goes on sale, you get a push notification on either your phone or your laptop letting you know that your item is on sale and you can buy it for a cheaper price. So I have actually saved a couple of these items on my shop tagger page in the past to test it out, see how it works and I have always been pleasantly surprised. On the ASOS website you can obviously add items to your favorites and you know when a sale comes around you can scroll down and see whether it's in the sale but with shop tagger obviously you can put every website you shop on all in one place so you don't have to keep going through different wish lists and different favorites and it is sorry about that plane and it is super super easy to do so if you guys are interested in trying out shop tagger then it is linked down below for you guys it's really easy to use and it can save you a lot of money if you use it regularly so yeah so for me a prime example and the first item I'm going to show you of me wanting an item but not wanting to pay full price for it is a bit of an out there one so this first item um, is actually the example I'm going to use my little anecdote for you I love this hat okay <laughs> I love this hat it's from Savage Rainbow and Full price, it was, hang on, shall I get up the full price so you can see? So full price, this is £65. And this is not the kind, you know my style, this is not the kind of thing I would wear on a day-to-day -day basis. However, I really want this for festival season next year. So I added this onto my shop tagger page uh, a few weeks ago before the summer sales hit. And I got a notification telling me that this was on sale and I managed to get it for £39, which is still expensive for a festival accessory, but the quality of this and how stinking cool it is, 100% worth it. Let me talk you through it. So this is like a military hat style and it's got rainbow glitter, crystal embellishments, like holographic, crazy hollow cap it is so amazing but i thought this would look amazing with quite a simple festival outfit a bit of body glitter and then a crazy crazy accessory and i have had my eye on this for so long and i'm so excited that i finally managed to get it i don't know what's got into me but i've gone completely hat crazy so i got two other hats the first one's not very exciting um it's actually another black Baker Boy cap. I've lost my Baker Boy cap. I've got my leatherette one, but I have lost my regular like fabric 
Baker Boy cap and I really wanted to replace it because I used to wear this so, so much before I lost it. This I got for half price. It went down from £20 to £10 and it's just such a classic, such a staple. The rage of the Baker Boy cap is kind of over now, which I'm quite glad about because it means I can start wearing mine again. <laughs> they make every look look a little bit cooler. Um, and yeah, I don't know if I said this is from Sacred Orc. Finally, this is like super out of my comfort zone, but I picked up this hat from Misguided and it's kind of like a Western inspired fedora, which I think is so cool. It's a black kind of felt-ish feeling fedora hat, really nice and structured, but it's got this really, really cool like studded brown belt around the what's this called the like peak of the hat i don't know what is that called i thought this would be great for like a bad hair day i thought this would work in the summer but also in autumn winter i just love it i think hats just make you look really cool but i feel like hats are quite hard to wear in the summer apart from like cats so I'm really excited to wear that. Okay, the final accessory and then we can get onto the clothes. You guys know I am a massive sun worshipper. I love the sun. I love when it's bright and warm outside. It just makes me so happy. It makes me significantly happier. And I always want to have a little bit of sunshine with me. So I saw this... I saw this gorgeous um, gold-plated necklace from Aurelia London and it is a little sunshine. Obviously, again, I'll show you a close-up, but I just thought this was really, really sweet, like a chubby little sunshine that will go with my everyday necklace that I love to wear. Um, and this was £10.50 down from £18. Oh, hello. Hi. Thank you. My hair's having a bit of a moment today, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so this is a very top-heavy haul. Um, lots and lots of tops, um, and they're all kind of similar style, floaty. My favourite, basically. And the first one is actually the top I am wearing right now. I absolutely love this top. And again, I've had my eye on this for ages, but this is pricey. So this was originally £108, which for me, a top, for £108 is steep. That's, no. I even think that how much I paid was still pretty, pretty expensive. But how long I've had my eye on it and how beautifully detailed this is, um, I went for it. So this is from Free People. And it's this gorgeous kind of balloony sleeved, bohemian um, ruched top. It's in this beautiful kind of nude shade with all this stunning embroidery. I love this. I'm gonna wear this so much. As always, everything I'm talking about is linked down below. Fingers crossed the sale is still on by the time this video goes live. Um, it should be. I'm really sorry if it's not, but go down there straight away if you like any of these pieces because they might still be in stock and they might still be on sale. So, yes, this is stunning. I actually sized down. Normally, I'm like a large and free people, but I think I got this on... A in a medium and it fits me like a glove so yeah this next item is another little bardo top but this one's black with polka dots i'm really into black and white at the moment um i i don't know i'm just loving monochromatic like lines and things like that which is very different for me i'm not normally like a mono i like color so yeah but i'm really loving this i think it's super i think it's really cute and flirty it's got lovely floaty sleeves um again nice and flattering on me it's very very cropped and very very lightweight this was from love and other things and this was 22 pounds but i got it for 15 so a little bit of a save on this one too okay you're gonna think i'm crazy but i picked up two different sunflower tops and they are very similar first one is this top here. This is actually half of a co-ord. There are trousers that go with this, but I didn't get the trousers, I just got the top. So it is a bat wing, um, polka dot, black and white top with sunflowers all over it. Um, it's got a super deep V, it's really, really cropped, and it has got these lovely, it's got little cuffs with buttons, lovely big sleeves. And I just thought this would be so nice for like evenings out, but also daytime. Um, this was originally £30 and I got it for £18. It's really thin and light, but it doesn't feel like bad quality. 
It's just ASOS owned and I'm so excited to style this up. You know, my love affair with sunflowers. I love sunflowers. So anything with sunflowers on it, I'm like, yoink, <laughs> thank you so much. And then the other sunflower top is slightly different. So this is just plain black with um, the bright sunflowers. It has got a fake button up detail down the front. These aren't real buttons. Again, it's a Bardo style with tiny little kind of split clap clap <laughs> capped sleeves and it's actually quite long line so I wear this tucked into jeans I wore this out for dinner the other day and I felt really really good in it and I got loads of compliments which is always very nice this is from blend she Stephanie never heard of that brand before this also was originally 30 pounds and I managed to get this one for 22 pounds exciting I picked up some socks I'm literally just taking these out of the box is anyone else like this is Oh, it's got, oh, they've got detail on them. Is anyone else like this? Does anyone else steal their dad's and their boyfriend's or their brother's socks? I never buy my own socks unless they're like funny socks, like specific socks that I want. So I never buy my own. So I always just steal Tim's and my dad's. And my dad is kind of used to it because I've been doing it since I was little. But Tim gets so angry. I do it to everyone. I have loads of my friends socks all my friends boyfriends socks i steal people's socks all the time because it's just one of those things i never buy because i always just have loads of them because i've borrowed so many pairs so i thought emma get yourself some socks so i picked up these fruitcake socks these were originally 12 pounds and i got them for six i'm not being funny i actually hate myself for this um because i'm gonna have to try this on but i picked up a jumper and this is hot even holding it is making me hot. This jumper is from Monkey and it's this amazing like fluffy fabric. It's like a gorgeous blue with green, pink and like a lighter blue bobbles running through it. It's really oversized and baggy, exactly how I like my jumpers. And I've had my eye on this for ages so when it came on sale I was like, oh yeah, well I've got to get it. But I'm not going to wear this anytime soon and I have to try this on for the cutaway and I am uh, not, not in any way, shape or form looking forward to that. But the colours are stunning and I can't wait to wear this in the winter and I had to swipe it at the price so it was originally 35 and I got it for £17.50 so I thought while it's on sale I have to get it. Do you not think that colour is just so stunning? On to the next thing. Oh, okay. Pajamas. I love pajamas. Um, I got two pajama type things. I have wanted this nighty for the longest time. It is um, again a sosone and it is a caution slippery bananas um, nighty. So it's kind of like a giant sweatshirt. So it's like sweatshirt sleeves, sweatshirt fabric um it's like a mini length kind of looks like it's been cut off at the bottom but it is so cute um it's a gorgeous like pastel lilac with yellow bananas all over it with like different expressions and then a big old caution in the middle i love this i think this is so cute 22 pounds to 11 pounds so i got this half price baby <laughs> and i am always on the lookout for pajama bottoms so when I saw these, I had to get them. You know what I'm like at the moment with my monochromatic. These are some white jogging bottoms. They are tight at the bottom and they've just got black triangles all over them. And I thought this was quite funny because people who kind of know about my channel but don't really get it, like don't really watch it, are always like, oh yeah, like Emma's triangle. I'm like, it's rectangle. Like Tim's mum always calls it Emma's triangle. And so I thought I would get some triangle pajama bottoms because uh, <laughs> I'm kind of shady like that so yeah I really really love these exactly what I love super soft and these were down from 20 pounds to 12 so I could not say no final item is definitely my favorite I think I've already posted pictures of me wearing this on my Instagram I have to show you it here I've wanted this jacket for so long this is a cheap monday jacket which was originally a hundred pounds i got it for 50 so i got this half price i would happily pay 50 pounds for a denim jacket a hundred is a bit more like but 50 for me for a denim jacket and a nice quality one is a good price perfect shade of light almost acid wash denim 
Um, I have a denim jacket and I never wear it because it's just not what I wanted. I want it to be massive, oversized, and the perfect shade. And honestly, this fits the bill. It's also got a really cool rip at the back, which some people are a bit like, is that intentional? I like it. Like when the back of, like my back's a bit tan, you know, you can see a little bit of skin at the back. I think it's quite sexy. I mean, you know, I think that's a bit of a like, you love it or you hate it, you get it or you don't kind of thing. And that's fine by me because I'm the one wearing it, but I love this. Okay, so those are all of the items I've recently picked up from the ASOS sale. I have actually done a big ASOS non-sale haul as well. So I'll probably film that as well and get that up for you soon because hair. Because I haven't done a haul in ages, but I have got a couple of hauls coming up. But I really hope you enjoyed this video. I've linked everything I've picked up down below if you'd like to buy them or look at them or whatever. I've also linked Shop Tagger down below, obviously, if you'd like to uh, use it in the future for sales, save yourself a little bit of money. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think of the background. How are we feeling? Throwing it back. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Have the best day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.